Appalachian Wireless has some of the best data rates in wireless on our plans, and not to mention an amazing deal on one of our hottest smartphones. But that's all the time I have to explain. See store for details. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. This week is National Work Zone Safety Awareness Week. As warm weather approaches, construction crews will be out fixing, cleaning, and preparing our roadways. Officials would like to remind motorists to be alert and watch for workers. We were fortunate in District 12. We had only five incidents within our district, uh, none of them major, no injuries. However, because there were only a few collisions last year, that doesn't mean motorists can relax. We realize it's an imposition, but to make the road safe for our traveling neighbors and everything, we'll hold you up for some time, hopefully not more than 20 minutes at a time. When we have a lane closure on any four lane, we have, along with our signs, we have arrow boards out to indicate for the traffic to move left or right, depending on where the work's being done. And one of the things that I found out is that a lot of our uh, collisions happen in what's called a queue, which is where the traffic backs up or slowed down. One of the things that cause that is our people waiting to the last minute to transition left or right. April is also National Distracted Driving Awareness Month. Officials say it's important not to text and drive, especially in work zones. It's a social media world that we live in. There's a lot of interaction with cell phones and stuff like that. Of course, in Kentucky, it's against the law to use or operate a cell phone while you're driving. It's 10 times more important that you not do that through a work zone because a split-second decision in a work zone can not only mean your life, but a lot of other people's lives, too. Nationally, there are 13 work zone injuries per minute and 13 deaths per hour. Reporting in Pikeville for EKB News, I'm Shelby Still.